Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got She Modern Domestic Violence Awareness Month collaboration. I've started off with the Unagella tips on my nails. There we go. This is Illamite Shipwrecked. It's kind of a purpley gray. I have applied a sticky base and now I'm applying Shipwrecked to the nails. These are rather long for me. I have grown my natural nails out that long before, but it's just not a comfortable, um, doable look for me on a day-to-day -day basis. There we go, having that free edge. Here we go for a second coat of Shipwrecked. <clears throat> and I will have a link. This was an Instagram collaboration, so I will have a list of other other participants listed down below. I'm going to top these with INMs out the door. Get them to dry down. Isn't that such a pretty base polish? It's like a soft dove gray with purple in it. Purple and blue sh shimmer. Mm. And there it is on its own. Now I'm going to top this with Anchor and Hearts Sea Glass Fairy Slipper Matte Top Coat. Because with this being a She Modern collab, I need to get ready to do some She Modern stuff. There's what it looks like matte. I'll be using Maniology M. Oh, I think it's uh, 153. This is kind of like the awareness plate with the ribbons. I'll be using my Fabio Nell Stamper and an H. La Cosador Scraper. This is Neon Violet Stamping Sticky Polish and Shimmer Royal Purple Powder. From both from She Modern, and that's what we're using today. Got to get that blue film off this plate and wipe it down with some acetone real quick. That way we're ready to play. So I am going in with the sticky stamping polish first. Remember, you don't have to work fast with these. You can take your time. I know that if you've been stamping for a while, you may have issues like me with the trying to do it all too fast. So I'm putting that image on my middle fingernail. It's so pretty. I'm going to clean my stamper off on a lint roller. And then I'm going to flip this plate or scoot it. Flip it, scoot it, make it move. Get it over to the middle so I'm scraping out onto my little baby mat. Oh, got to go to the side with that one. We go roll it pick it up I'm gonna use a little piece of tape to pull up the excess I like this because it's a bunch of ribbons inside a ribbon so very cute image I'm gonna put that one on my ring finger now now I've got those down I'm gonna start tapping out of this violet or blue or bluish purple actually no it's just straight up purple I'm not even gonna call it blue do this purple onto these tap it out and tap it down into the polish now I do let these sit for quite a while um, while I do my cleanup of my mat and stuff before I brush them off I do get the excess off my tapping finger on my lint roller I gotta go flip the cotton ball oh, oh it's not wanting to grab hold good come on girl get it together all right, thankfully, it's given my, that polish and dust a little time to, you know, solidify, get all, you know, ready to be brushed and dusted. I'm going to take my soft, fluffy brush and go at it. Got them dusted off. I'm going in with a piece of tape to get some of the glitter off of my skin, some of that, some of that dusting. It's, you know. It's the casualty of playing with this type of medium. It's all good though, because in the end, the look is worth it. All right. So I'm going in with my cleanup brush here, just around the edge, and get up some more of that glittery dust up off my skin. Get on that side there. Ooh, wee. Those are shiny. 
I am going to top these with the Maniology Smudge Free Top Coat first. Give that a few minutes or a few seconds to dry because it really didn't take it long. And then I'm going to top it with my Posh Top Coat. I'm going to seal it in. Call it to doing. Oh, I do believe Woody's gonna have to come out here and clean up my mess. Mm hmm. I'm a messy girl. First, we're gonna get this one finished. I'm not used to my nails being this long, so I had to reevaluate my top coat on the brush situation. Hi, Woody. How you doing? Thank you very much. All right. And now to cover this other one up. With some glossy fast drying top coat. There we go. And I really did enjoy doing this collab with these ladies, and I hope you'll go check out what they've done to help support the theme. There we go, get that one done too. Cap that free edge. There we go. And here is my swatch photo. I do hope you enjoyed this one. I want to thank you for watching. Until next time. Be good to yourself.